Okay. So, oh, something's happening. Cool. Cool. <laughs> cool. Okay. Okay. How do I pop up the chat? Yay. <laughs> okay. Good. All right. So this is After Effects. If nobody's seen it before, this is a titan of a program. I actually, even with my big ass fancy new um, computer, don't have enough RAM for the minimum requirement to run this thing. So I don't know if trying to stream it is going to make it explode. <laughs> so if that happens, we're just gonna... <laughs> I'm just gonna go do more art for the next video. But for now... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm giggling because I'm 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 very intimidated about what I'm going to attempt. Cause I've been um I've been thinking about this animation and exactly how I'm going to do it for a couple days now and I'm I'm a little bit like worried that I'm gonna I'm not gonna do a very good job. Okay, so let's see here. Ugh. Bo has 32 individual layers that need to be animated. So let me pop this sucker right in here. We can continue on. <laughs> Come and welcome to my waking nightmare. All right. Because animating is not easy. Let's see here then. Oh God in heaven. Oh no. <laughs> it's because I forgot to put her head on. Okay. Uh. Her head is to her torso. Okay, so now we. <laughs> it's nightmare. Ow, and her irises will be able to be moved around, which is nice. So she'll be able to look, she'll be able to roll her eyes at you. Ugh, my god. These people. <laughs> okay. Put her eyes back. Oopsie. Oh god. You guys are gonna have some interesting screenshots, aren't you? One of the reasons of doing these streams is to show you how freaking hard I work on these stupid videos. This is gonna be the left upper arm. <laughs> Yes, Vimu Productions. I feel exhausted already. <laughs> it's it, it's just that I'm I'm racking my brain over exactly how to do this. Regular scarf. If I was just doing a, like a coral style animation, this would be way easier. But this is very experimental. She has 34 different layers that I'm working with right now. I'm just happy that it's all working. Like. This computer is amazing! Oh, it's gonna bring a tear to my eye that this is actually working. And then maybe if I have her torso rotate. Oh god! Oh no, that's, a, that's the exact opposite of what I wanted! What happened? Oh. Oh, it's. Is it. Oh god! Oh lord! Okay. Okay. Oh no. What have I done? Oh god. <laughs> oh god. <gasps> let me let me just take all of these off first. No, I did not know it did that. I feel like I'm 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 like a master of Photoshop. I don't I don't know anything about this program. <laughs> Get the rest of these in unless I wanna no they're gonna they're gonna move independently of one another so if I move this yeah that'll that'll still shake independently but it still looks like it's on the inside of this thing because I have an inside layer on there that's the purpose of that Oh, nope, get over there. 
I have to put the anchors on now because if I try to do it later, it'll mess everything up. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. This is a problem. This is a very big problem. No, <laughs> no. Okay. Okay, I have to open up Photoshop. I have to fix this. Gotta fix this. Vimi, <laughs> I don't know what's happening either. What I'm not okay with right now, um, I'll sh I'll have to show you what I mean. Making animated illustrations is not easy. <laughs> and I had to consign myself to this life. Here we go. Here she is, looking cute as ever. See that? There needs to be stuff over here because if I move it, you're gonna see all of that. And that's what I should have already taken into account for. <laughs> I, I, I should have already figured that I needed to do this. I don't want to check the server, <laughs> but I will on my phone. Let me get this shit out. <laughs> if I don't value my, okay, okay. I have to, I have to check the server. What are you, what the hell are you guys talking about? <laughs> Export layers to files. Okay, what's going on in here? <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> For anybody that's not in my <laughs> in my server, everybody's just. <laughs> Posting pictures of a cursed bow with all the layers taken off. <laughs> I've been animating like this for only a couple months. I use Photoshop to draw. I've been animating for about six years, maybe. Um, oh, what are these called? So these, these are my fixed layers. Fixed layers, that's what I'll call it. Okay, and do not trim layers and export. Boom, let's do it. So now what happens if I try to move the skirt? Much better. Now you can't see, like even if I moved it up here, which I would never do, you won't be able to see the other sides. That's perfect, perfect. Exactly what I need, exactly what I needed. All right, that is, that is nice. And save. To be honest, Maya, not a lot has happened. <laughs> um, I've mostly just been struggling. There we go. Wee, I'm so cute. Look at me. My lips both. I'm just so fucking cute. Look at my fucking face. <laughs> it's gonna move. Wee, wee, wee. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, my squeak laugh is coming out. That's no good. <laughs> I'll I'll sometimes I'll sometimes laugh like <laughs> or just like this really like hearty <laughs> And then other times I'm like, <laughs> so I'm like, I don't know, my, my laughs, my laughs are very, very varied. Very, very varied. See, look, she has fingers. You just can't see them behind the scarf. Okay, that works. <laughs> my, which laugh I have depends, <laughs> depends on what I'm laughing at and my company, like who I'm with. And yep, yeah, that can move. 
I'm happy this is all coming together. Freaking finally. Because <laughs> I was really, really worried. And by coming all together, I mean... It's... <laughs> I'm, I haven't even animated it yet. Oh, cool. I'm going to be able to give, give her give her a little bit of... Get a little bit of attitude shoulders. <laughs> attitude. <laughs> this has been an hour already? God damn, I'm sorry. This has been an hour of nothingness. I should have set all this up before I did the stream. I was too busy talking about the dark crystal. <laughs> oh, I'm a failure. I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus Christmas. All right. Okay. I actually like Marina better. It's not that I don't like Pearl. It's that I, the moment that I saw Marina, I was instantly in love and I was like, yes, here she is, my queen. So, okay. Um, It appears that Bo is all... Uh, anchored up, linked, parented, everything looks like it's going together after an hour. This puts into perspective how long I work on these animations. It took an hour just to get it set up correctly. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so now I have to think about um, how long I want the animation to go for. Yes! Yes! I figured it out! Yes! Yes, that's how I'm, that's how I'm going to do it. This is exactly how I'm going to do it. Except far less rotation. Far less rotation. At least I figured at least I figured out how exactly she's going to move. So I have to set up a base movement that everything else will follow from. I, I, I put myself like six feet away from the mic. I'm sorry. I tried not to have that be so loud. <sighs> okay. Um, okay, the way that I normally do it is I would normally have, let's say, you know, I would start with a single movement where I would have the character move and then every other movement would follow through that. You know, the, the head would follow... Uh, would follow the body and then the hair would follow the head and so on and so forth all of this like overlapping motion you know you, you have you have a piece of paper in your hand you move your hand the paper is going to trail behind it that's how all this uh, animation works so i have to find a good starting base animation to build everything else on so that's where this comes in with that hip pivot uh hip pivot that i made at the bottom yeah, Riva and Lumi, th those are, uh, uh, Lumi was definitely the hardest because of all those goddamn tentacles. Riva was extremely easy. Uh, but they were definitely not as hard as trying to figure out this malarkey right here. But now that I have it figured out, I think it's just going to be a matter of just, like, getting it, getting it to work. Uh, here we go, our hips don't lie. Our legs are now complete. Don't gotta do no more shit with these legs. Let's lock those layers. They are done. Okay. Jabril! Jabril here is here! Jabril, my baby! Okay. I'm trying to make her move, it's not easy. I actually do play Minecraft, uh, yeah. Minceraft, as me and my boyfriend like to call it. Uh, we have built a couple, a couple worlds every once in a while. We had one recently, and then we stopped. <laughs> and now we want to play art again. Odd uh, art, cuh, not art. Now they have a thing, stay for- Yeah, yeah, till our fates align, let your colors shine. That's, that's what their, their thing is. So. They have designs, they have a catchphrase, um, they have a pose. I haven't drawn the pose yet, actually. That's the one thing that I need to do for these guys. They're gonna have a background for their set. They have a logo. And now they have a song. 
And they have voices. And they have icons. Flare, I have not thought of that. I would assume Reyna would uh, not like people touching her. She's kind of a holier-than-thou person who's just like, oh my god, all these people are beneath me. You know, not not quite that serious. But, you know, she just she just doesn't really like people that much. Except for Bo. She likes Bo. And then Bo is anxious around large crowds, but she loves people. So she would adore hugs. I think, I think that's... That's what would go on with these characters. The next one is tea versus coffee. Bo is on coffee and Reyna is on tea. And this is why I'm making these animations. Because I want them to actually announce it in a little video. And I need to make all their animations for it. We're also going to have... Um, uh, I, think, I think it was my mod that suggested it. I don't remember. <laughs> it was... Um, Board games versus card games. I think I want Bo to be on board games and Reyna to be on card games. She'll think that card games are more sophisticated. Bo will like, and she'll think that like, uh, board games are more like play things. Bull deal like, well, you know, like there's there's chess. So and probably I'll make some kind of a reference to Cards Against Humanity, but like give it like a fish pun. <laughs> and, Reyna will say something like, hey, we can't, we can't talk about that on television or something like that. I'm just spitballing ideas for what I want to do for their dialogue. There we go! Yes! Yes! I'm far away from the mic! I'm celebrating very far away from the mic! Look at that! That's a, that's a nearly perfect loop! <laughs> Licking government skills. Yes! Yes! I'm trying to I'm trying to do anything loud or far away from the microphone. Okay, good. Okay. Ow. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you know, uh <laughs> I'm really hyper right now. I'm stimming out. Uh, for, for those that don't know, I have Asperger's Syndrome, which is, um, it's a, it's a form of autism, so getting, getting, getting a little stimmy, a little, a little, uh, <laughs> a little, st a little overstimulated, in, in a good way. It's technically just one animation loop. So what I do is then I take that loop and in Premiere, I'll just copy-paste it a million times to suit however long the animation needs to be going for. So for these guys, I'm gonna have multiple different blinking loops, multiple different eye loops. I'm going- I have different, um, expressions, so- and, uh, poses for their bodies. Uh, just minute differences of the poses, like their arms and such, that I'm going to swap in and out and export them all as these different files and I can just plug them into the video where I need them to be. So as soon as I get all these animations done, <laughs> uh, popping out little Octoprism news videos is gonna be really easy. Just getting it all there is the hard part first. Oh yeah, Meyer, I definitely want to make ranked battles part of the, uh, uh, part of the new Splatfest. Look at the little fins! Oh my god! Oh, 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 they're moving too much though. I need to, I need to not spit too much. Jabril is the best person here. And I will fight anyone who says otherwise. Hey, let me easy ease that. No, Jabby. But ha ha, I'm not in the chat. And I'm talking about people in the chat. Jabril Jib 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 for life. Jabril Jib 2020. <laughs> yes, Plort. Blort? <laughs> Plort Blort, yeah. I created Octoprism. I created everything about them. Except for the fact that they're octolings. I did not invent what an octoling is. Uh, yeah. 
and I'm not making their music. I am singing for their music though, but Sampling Kid, whose music I used all throughout my newest video, is making the music. Well, I mean, I'm I'm just I'm gonna sing. That's that's how that's gonna work. <laughs> I will be providing Reina's voice. Oh, too thick, too thick. I really love the Game Theory episodes about Doki Doki Literature Club, and I feel so alone in liking Game Theory because, like, even though they're incredibly popular, like if I mention them, they're like people are like oh. GAME THEORY! Like, me, a person of culture, would never like GAME THEORY! And I'm like, the, the video's amazing! What are you talking about? Not every video of theirs is good, but they got a lot of good ones! <sighs> so, I don't know. Yes, I did, uh, I did do animation in school. If any of you want to just go onto, um, my channel, I have my animations on there. I have two student films, the last of which destroyed my hands almost irreparably forever. Luckily my hands don't hurt right now, which is very, very good. I think maybe because I'm just not focusing on it. But I, I worked um, 17 hours a day, every single day, including weekends for several months when I was in senior year of college to the point where I wasn't able to work on some other projects for my classes but <laughs> all of my teachers understood and they were perfectly fine with that and like I'd show them the work that I was doing for my senior project and they'd be like oh okay yeah I, I, I get it now my senior project by the way is um it's called soup it's on my channel you'll you'll be able to find it well, I, re I really started getting into animation when I got into college, actually. I actually didn't go to animation specifically f I mean, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't go to college specifically for animation. I actually went there for illustration. I was an illustration major because uh, I went to an art school. But that did not last for more than the very first semester because uh, I... S I just kind of started seeing um, like the entertainment arts field, which is what I ended up going into. Bye, Meyer. I love you. Um. So, oh, thank you, Kirby. Uh, yeah, I I can't remember exactly what it was that got me into that, but I remember an upperclassman telling me, "Yeah, the rest of illustration is just." Like, still lives and drawing pictures of, what, what was it that she said, like, um, like just drawing pictures of fruit or something like that. I did have to draw a lot of naked people. There were a lot of naked people that I had to draw. But when you're in college, hopefully, you're mature enough to handle that. So, I got used to it. Once you, once you see a dozen naked old people, you've seen them all. And it really did help uh, who, who I am as an artist because it helps to draw the body and learn how to draw the body by looking at an actual body day after day for six hours. I had a six hour drawing class. We were standing for six hours just at easels drawing naked people. That's what we were doing. That was art school. It wasn't torture. It was like, because like, you have to, you have to be mature about it. You're, you're in college. You're an adult. Oh, it's, it's a naked person, but it's not an erotic naked person. It's like, it's like an old wrinkly lady or a really big fat guy or just, I don't know, a woman in her twenties. Just a wide range of different people and you just kind of get used to the fact that they're naked so and then you draw and, and you're you're not really focused on it you're trying you're focused on trying to draw them that's another thing that i'm just like oh god okay how, how do i how do i get the shape of her arm to work like for, forget that she's naked how, how do i draw her goddamn face <laughs> 
like her, her, the, the curve on her foot. I can't get it right. Teacher, help me, please. So, you know. Yeah, there was a lot of old naked people. Why my first figure drawing class, there was nothing but young, pretty black women. I think the teacher had a thing for them because throughout the entire semester, those were the only models that he hired. Like the multiple different kinds of models and they were all young black women. I think he had a type. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad like it's I'm playing it up for like dramatics but it wasn't a bad thing I really enjoyed art school the only sucky thing is that now I'm saddled with loans for the rest of my life but yes he did have taste they were all extremely beautiful it was fun to draw them um what was I saying uh, but the good thing is that now that this YouTube thing is kicking off for me, uh, I may be able to escape these loans someday. Because it, it's really gonna help me actually be able to live in the adult world and, you know, pay for things. And it's extremely exciting that maybe I could make a living doing what I love. Oh my god, who would've, who would've thought? Because I work at a cafe. I went to art school for four years, I pay almost $500 a month on three loans. Not, it's not including the eight loans that are just sitting there doing nothing because I can't legally pay them. So being monetized on YouTube and actually making money is like extremely important to me. It's, it's a dream come true. I'm so happy that this happened, which is why I want to make more stuff for all of you guys. And, and, this, and this is just a beautiful thing. I'm so glad I met you too, Jabby. <laughs> Your comment that you left on one of my videos that you normally don't like, uh, you normally don't like those kinds of videos, but you really liked mine, that one stuck out to me so much. And that's, that, that's, that's one senpai noticed you. <laughs> Art school is not just drawing naked people. Art school is not just painting still lives. Art school is many, many things. <laughs> I mean, um, I was just talking to my Discord earlier about how, I wonder how it's doing, <laughs> uh, about how I had a class called Playing the Self. I have another video on my YouTube channel called um, You Just Don't Know. It's a weird experimental film that I made while I was in that class. Um, it's, it's very bizarre. Uh, but I made it while I was in that class and it was like, when I was first in that class, I hated it. I, I did not get it. I was like, this, this is bullshit. This is, I don't get it. Cause it's all very abstract stuff. Like the best way to explain it is that our very first assignment, make a self portrait. One person took a photo of the inside of their vacuum cleaner and that was their self-portrait. The only thing I remember about it was that there was a puzzle piece in there and that was one of the things that we analyzed. So, I mean, your, your self-portrait is, is the inside of a vacuum cleaner. But we sat there for 10 minutes analyzing in every single way that it can mean something about himself and eventually I was drawn in eventually I loved that class it was one of my favorites it was one of my favorite teachers I made some of my best work in that class I have a photo series called flesh landscape it's all a bunch of uh, uh, like extremely like hyper close-up images of like places on my face or my hands and it's just this very alien looking uh, like skin and uh, like flesh tones. It's so cool looking and I never would have thought to do it were it not for that class. So, and that's that has nothing to do with painting. That has nothing to do with drawing or what you'd assume art school to be about. But art school, of course, depending on which one you go to, is many, many things. And of course you can decide which weird classes you go into. And it's not all art either. I had a class called Memory, Sleep, and Dreams where we learned about those exact things. And it was really great because um, 
my my teacher was like, okay guys, we're gonna have to talk about Freud. I want to let it out there right now that I do not agree with a single thing this man fought. But I'm like, yes, thank you so much, teacher. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to have to learn about Freud, but because he was such a like, revolutionary, like, you know, thought person with, uh, with um, a revolutionary thinker with dreams that we had to learn about him, but we got to learn about other stuff too. Uh, I learned about dementia in that class, learned about sleep studies, and now I actually have to go to sleep studies. I had one recently to find out if I had sleep apnea, which I don't, which is good, because sleep apnea means you stop breathing in your sleep. But still, point being on this tangent, art school is great, and you should definitely go, but only if you can afford it, because you may be saddled with your student loans that you'll never escape. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Yay, my mom is home. Mama! I don't know, mom. I did not birth you from my loins. <laughs> that would be a conversation. I turned around. It wasn't my mom, it was my boyfriend. Alright. That's true. It, yes, it is. Go. Look at this! Look, 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 look! Look at her! She's moving. Yes, she is. He's not impressed in the least. It's okay. <laughs> I'm not impressed by your art. I'm impressed by your soul. Oh. The beauty of your heart. Mm. <laughs> You're just playing it up for the stream. <laughs> you don't love me. <laughs> nope, I don't. Th she's on to me. <laughs> you, don't, you don't need to say, hey, tell him I said hi. He's reading the screen right now. <laughs> I will never be impressed. I'm not, it's not possible. I cannot be impressed by any, if Caitlyn exploded into a supernova right before my eyes and then turned into a clown, then I would be impressed. This is just his humor. By the way, we call him Law because in my Discord server he's my top mod and he called himself The Law. So that's just what we all call him now because I don't know if you're comfortable with people knowing your name. I so it's not as much a level of comfort as much as I sound way cooler. <laughs> Being the law. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just the law. He is the law. Now nah, he loves me. But that was so awkward. It's Mamo. It's it's not mom. Alright, where's my Coke? I didn't bring you one. It's in the fridge. I lit the candles okay, yeah. like you wanted. We have dogs that pee all over the house, so it smells nasty here. So we light candles. Well, it's really only one dog that does it. Oh, they're so cute though. Yeah, I have a chihuahua, but he's not the culprit. I mean, he sometimes is, but rarely it's mostly my miniature schnauzer. My chihuahua is the greatest thing to grace this planet. This morning, I woke up to him coming up to me and uh, snuggling my face, and then he tried to lay on lay on my pillow, and he tries to put his paw, he'll, he'll, he'll reach his paw out and put it on you if he wants attention, and he does that all day long. Cause he just, <laughs> he, 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 just he just wants love. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Yeah, I, th I, th I think I think we're done here. I will continue this some other time. Probably not on stream. I think the next time I stream, well. <coughs> Thanks, darling. That was, that was really. He walks over to me, taps me on the shoulder. God damn it. <laughs> My boyfriend, everybody. I think I'm gonna do Reina for the next stream. And that I'll I'll have her set up so that the stream will just be the animation. All right.